Hello my loves and welcome back to my little corner where we have a Stitch Fix box today. I absolutely love my Stitch Fix. I've had it for so long. I don't even know what unboxing this is. I honestly have to look. So this is my 18th unboxing. Um, I've been with them for quite a while, yes. Um, I absolutely love them and honestly I'm an affiliate. They are so sweet. They sent me the cutest black scarf for Christmas. I thought it was so nice. So thank you Stitch Fix for being so amazing and thank you guys for watching my Stitch Fix videos because if it wasn't for you I would never have gotten invited into the program. You guys are so sweet for watching all my little unboxings. I absolutely love you and if you're new to my channel don't leave without subscribing. I have other styling subscriptions that I have as well as beauty subscriptions and I shop way too much so make sure you check out my other videos before you click on somebody else's. All right, without any further ado, I think we should dive into this box because A, it got a little beat up in transit, and B, it feels really, really light. I'm like, are we into spring already? Um, kind of a thin package. I feel like winter, I, I've been getting big boxes. So anyways, good things come in small packages. So let's check out what's inside. So Stitch Fix, if you're not familiar with it, you get five items. You pay $20 for the styling fee, but that gets credited to whatever you decide to keep. And if you keep everything, you get a discount on everything. I like Stitch Fix because they have amazing customer service. One of my subscribers told me about um, a pair of jeans that she got that luckily did this while she was at home, but split down the back inseam or seam. I don't know what that's called, but anyways, the seam that goes down your lovely booty split so they were amazing enough to give her a refund on those jeans which was really cool I've never had any issues with anything that I've kept before I did notice one shirt had like a rolled cuff uh, seam right here and this side had no seam whatsoever I think that might have been a mistake but I didn't catch it before purchasing it um but yeah that's like the only mistake I can think of and it's still kind of cute I just I chalk it up to style like it's meant to be like this inside of your packages if you've never gotten a stitch fix box you've got all your goodies you've got your return bag you've got a little envelope with your styling card in it and the note from your stylist as well as your package which I'm trying really hard not to take a peek at I like to read the card from Alexandra because guys I if you've never watched one of my unboxings before I have the best stylist she's the bestest her name is Alexandra and she's awesome Speaking of Alexandra, let's read her little card. She says, Happy Fix Day, Karen. Can you believe it is nearly 2019? I It is 2019 now, now that I'm unboxing it. I actually just got this box today, so I got this on the first. I'm sure when she was styling me, though, it was before. I hope this fix fills you with cheer to ring in the new year. A new year means new beginnings. If you're up for getting out of your comfort zone, she's very good at sneaking me out of my comfort zone, a bit please let me know and I will be happy to oblige let me know what you're willing to try or I can surprise you next time you open your fix now let's get started I look so hard to find you a couple camis to add to your wardrobe yay I started off with this bold and totally gorgeous mesh detail blouse from lemon tart I really need some like basic camis like basic but also stylish to where I can wear them with my kimonos and still feel like cute you know what I mean like mm, stylish style with jeans or enjoy a night out with a faux leather skirt I also chose this scalloped halter blouse for you as well I knew the lace would really stand out to your style I literally live in this flannel top and know you will too it is the softest material ever what do you think XO Alexandra she knows I'm all about something soft and cozy okay so I'm gonna set our return bag aside right now but that bag always fits whatever they've sent me whether they've sent me shoes or not I'm gonna set our pricing sheet aside for now because I like to look at prices once I've had a chance to check out the pieces hopefully nothing got damaged because the box was a little bit beat up um, but let's check out what we got Oh, I see that flannel already. Oh, I can't wait to see everything. Okay, so let me go ahead and open up our bundle and see what we've got here. I'm such a goober. So this is the mesh cami. Oh, yes. Yes, yes. I love that already. That is so cute. I love how bold it is. It's got kind of an orange undertone for the red. This is the cami from Lemon Tart. It is a Davy Mesh Detail Blouse in red, size medium. So cute, I can't wait to try that on. The next top is by Fortune and Ivy. It is the Chai, 
chaya lace scalloped halter blouse it is black in a size medium and it is beautiful holy moses i don't know if you guys can see all the detail oh my gosh that is so soft that is so beautiful i cannot wait to try that on this is also by fortune and ivy this is in a size medium and it is the marcia sleeve cut out knit top in light purple i have a top kind of similar to this like as far as the material but it doesn't have these really cool sleeves it's got some like bat wing sleeves but this is really really cool so i'm excited to try that on because that is just interesting and i love the i love the like mixed material it's got black and purple in there it's so pretty the next top i'm pulling out of here is the rd is by rd style and it is the lonnie lace inset pullover okay Oh, is that pretty? I see the lace detail at the bottom. That is so cute. And it does feel like super duper soft too. How stinking cute. Loving that lace. And then here's the flannel she was talking about. This is by Mellow Day. It is the Amara One Pocket Flannel Top super soft like she said nice and long which is something i have to have in my flannel tops really really cute colors blue red white kind of a i don't know what that color blue is but really really pretty colors mixed in i think that's cute we'll have to try that on so we got a ton of tops to try on let's get with it Alrighty guys, so I have got the flannel on and okay, so I don't know about this one. It is super duper soft, like crazy, crazy soft. And I really do like the length and the hem on it, like how it's just like kind of curved down at the hem. I just don't know. I really, really do like it. Don't get me wrong. I think it's super comfortable, super duper cute. And I do like a lot of aspects about it. But I just don't know how many different flannels do I need. I feel like the ones that I have upstairs have more unique combinations than just like blue, red, and white. But oh, I don't know. It's so comfortable. We have so many tops to try on. There's no way I can afford all of them. So let's go try on. Let's just work from backwards, like from the end to the begin as to how we unbox them. I think that could be fun. Alrighty guys, so here is the pullover and this thing is actually kind of cool. So it kind of like is a little asymmetrical there and there's a zipper right there. Like if you wanted to unzip it, you can. <laughs> it's really cool, but the underlay only goes to the front. It's not in the back. I really wish it was in the back. I feel like I'm missing it there that it's just like regular cardigan from the back. Really cool shirt in the front. So, I don't know about this one though. I do like, it has a little bit of that like tulle or lace or whatever it is right here at the top. So that's pretty. And I like the neckline of it. I like the length of the sleeves and the material is super soft. And this is really cool. I do really love this one though. And it's like the more I look in the viewfinder, the more I'm falling in love with it. This is just really cute down here. Ah. Oh. So many choices and we still have what three tops to draw on uh, okay let's go get one more of them on okay guys so here is the cute little cutout shirt um hmm do i like it i i have this tattoo that i don't love and i want to cover one day like have it come up i don't know more feminine um so I don't know, I'm not a big fan of showing my shoulders. Like even when I wear a tank top, I'm usually like trying to cover it up with a kimono. But I do love everything else. I feel like if this didn't have the cutouts, I would like it more, but then it'd just be a regular little t-shirt. But it is really comfortable and cute. I don't know guys. I do know that we have two camis upstairs waiting for me. So let's go try on the black one. So I'm back in the black cami and I love this one. You guys know I love anything scalloped and the lace is absolutely perfect. I feel like this one looks so good with so many of the kimonos that I have. Oh man, this is like, this is what I need. This is what I need. Oh, it's just, I feel like it's just so elegant and classy with all the lace. So cute. 
<sighs> I'm loving it. I'm honestly loving all of these tops. I want them all. I wish I had a ton of money because I would keep them all as I was walking back upstairs in that last top. Yeah. It's starting to get harder and harder each and every fix as she gets to know me more. You have no idea. I have one more Cami to try on. I'll be right back. Oh my good lord, how cute is this? I'm absolutely loving this right here. Not to mention this bad boy is double lined. So freaking comfortable. So cute. Yes. Yes, please. I feel like this is the yin to my cobalt blue camis yang. I just absolutely love it. It feels so comfortable. I feel like this, yes. Every color now, please, every color. <laughs> so cute, but <laughs> we don't know how much she costs yet, so let's sit down and look over pricing before I fall in love completely. Okay, so we also had a little styling card that I can now take a little sneak peek at. So it shows some really cute ways to wear that little pullover, as well as both the camis and both of the shirts. Alright guys, I gotta look at pricing. I'm ready to like either cry or celebrate. Alright, here we go. The dreaded pricing sheet. The very first thing that's in here is kind of a heartbreaker. This cami right here is $58. It is the Lemon Tart Davy Mesh Detail Blouse. That is way too expensive for me to spend on a cami. It's so cute though. Oh my gosh, it's going to be so hard to send this one back. It is so cute, but I don't think I can afford that. I mean, like, I wanted, I was hoping to be able to afford both of the camis because I really, really love those. But anyways, moving on, $58. The next thing that's in here is the Mellow Day Amara One Pocket, One Pocket, One Pocket Flannel Top. So this bad boy, and it is $46. The next thing that I see the pricing on is the Fortune and Ivy Chai Lace Scalloped Halter. This bad boy is one of the cheapest things in the box and it's $38. So that's really where I expected to be with the camis, around $38. I'm gonna cry. The next thing that's on the pricing list is also $38 and that is the Fortune and Ivy Cutout Knit Top. So this bad boy also $38 and then the last thing on the list is the Tony Lace Inset Pullover. It's $68 so this is the most expensive thing in the box. I'm gonna have to think about this one because I honestly thought for sure without a doubt I was keeping this cami and maybe the black one. I know I love this cami. Oh, it's so cute. This cami is adorable. I just feel like $58 for a cami is a little, a little much for me on this. Oh, uh, uh, okay. So without a doubt, I'm definitely keeping the, I think that's a great price, $38 on that lace scalloped halter, the black one. I think that's a great price. This bad boy is heavy. It's covered everywhere. It'll look really, really cute with all of my kimonos but not as cute as this one would like I've already pictured this one with two kimonos I I am I am torn by two camis <laughs> do I spend 20 more dollars and keep this one or do I save myself 20 dollars and go with this one and desperately hunt for something similar to this cheaper Alexandra you have put me in a quandary I don't know what to do oh but I love you anyways, girl. So the entire total of my entire package would be $248. If I buy all, I get a 25% discount of $62, bringing my whole subtotal to $186. I've already paid $20, so I would only need to pay $166 to keep everything. However, that is well over my budget for this month. So I am going to have to limit myself to one, considering the prices. So. Hmm, I, I don't know. I might splurge and keep this one. I honestly might, but I think I will default to the black one if I decide I cannot splurge, which is, it'll, it'll probably be the black one. When we're thinking $20 difference in a cami, 
I'll probably stick with the black one. All right, my loves, sorry I wasn't able to keep everything. I know it's kind of a bummer, but I like doing Stitch Fix unboxings. They're fun. I get to try out a bunch of stuff. Sometimes I fall in love with something and I don't get to keep it, but you better damn well be sure I'm gonna wear it in the next video that I film so that I can have the memory of this beautiful top. Either way, if you guys like today's video, make sure you give me a big old thumbs up. And remember, if you're new to my channel, subscribe, please. Please. And speaking of new subscribers, one of the things that I love doing on my channel is just saying hello to a few of my new peeps. So hello Naomi White, DSTG11, that was the best way I could find to say that, Judy Hallwell, and Alexandria Bontraga. Thank you guys so much for subscribing to my channel. You guys are amazing. Alright my loves, I guess that's it. I'm going to let you go. I hope you have a lovely evening. Take care of yourselves. Bye!